But it's a long, long while. Theater is a kind of addiction. It's a beautiful, chaotic place for a writer. Even when you finish the work on the page, you never know how it's going to look when it's up there on stage. I've always felt that when a play comes together with all of its elements, the sound, the lighting, direction, acting and writing, it's a kind of miracle. And I haven't got time for the waiting game. Humor is essential for my writing. I don't mean humor only for entertainment. I, I use it to open up the audience to darker themes, the ones that are harder to digest. In The Trials of John Demianic, which played in Toronto, Victoria, and Vancouver, it, it was based on a Holocaust war crimes trial. It investigates the duality of humankind, how one can be capable of monstrous acts during wartime and, and go on to be a happily family man during more peaceful times. Okay, when I was 18, my favorite writers were Mordecai Richler and Michael Andachi. In many ways, my writing is about trying to fuse these two different sensibilities, the poetic and the comedic, with the hope of expressing a, a deeper humanism. My most recent play, House of Many Tongues, is set in a house in Jerusalem. Um, its ownership is disputed between a Palestinian family and an Israeli family. One of the important things for me in the writing was that I don't choose a side in the debate. For me, the tragedy in the conflict is that everybody is a, is a righteous victim. And uh, I have a book called Ambivalence that chronicles this journey to Jerusalem to look for this mythical house. I'm one of this year's recipients for the K.M. Hunter Award in theater. I'm sorry I can't be here tonight, but I'm at a writing residency in Stuttgart, Germany. <laughs>